47 points after not being named an all-star starter this week, easily outdueling his counterpart, Nikola Jokic. Stephen A., what statement did Joel Embiid make this afternoon? That he's a starter and that he's a potential league MVP. Last year in a head-to-head -head matchup in Philadelphia, didn't have such luck against Jokic. He did this time, and some people would argue that might have cost him the MVP vote. He got mine last year. Jokic got the trophy. I think this year we need to look at Embiid differently. And by the way, I voted him in as a starter for the All-Star game. I don't know what we, you know, disrespect he's talking about. Well, I mean, he didn't get it. We, we I, I voted for him as well, but he did not get named as such. How about the performance of MB today? You know what? If I'm Doc Rivers, I'm happy. I'm happy that he didn't win the MVP last year. I'm happy that he didn't get voted as an all-star starter because if he's going to come out and play mad with a chip on his shoulder like this, then guess what? We keep talking about the Celtics and Bucks, and rightfully so. Mm. But he on their heels. He Game is. Two games behind. You're right. Those two teams should be talked about because we've seen the Bucks do it and we've seen the Celtics actually do it. But the Cavs, the Nets, and now the Sixers in particular have a great opportunity in Philadelphia to make it to the conference final. And I appreciate Joel taking it personal yes. and putting a smack down against you. Know, they've won seven straight games. I mean, we need to start taking it. Since Tyrese Maxey came back and works his way back in, we need to take them serious. That was a great move by Doc Rivers. Big Perk schooled me on um, Maxey was going to come off the bench. It balances off their lineup. They do a great job of feeding the big fella. Yeah, I still would like to see Maxi in that starting lineup, and I'd like to see Thibel getting a little more playing time. Uh, but, That's but, just me. But That's I will me. say this. With Missoula and some of the mistakes I've seen him make over the last couple of weeks with the Celtics, this concern there, and Chris Middleton health is also a concern. Yep. This might be a golden opportunity for the Philadelphia 76 Again, right now, they're just two games back of Boston. Thank you for watching ESPN on YouTube. For live streaming sports and premium content, subscribe to ESPN+.